Hey there, welcome to another episode of Mundane Designs. I'm your host, Mundane. This video is part of my favorite series, and today we're going to be talking about my favorite PlayStation Portable games. Growing up, me and my grandparents traveled qu around quite a bit doing camping and visiting various places. And the thing that got to me the most was the travel time. It, I got really bored. I couldn't really read that well with, with the car bouncing around and stuff like that. And so, you know, this is what attracted me to handheld systems. And, you know, now we're going to be going over my favorite PlayStation Portable games. They're not presented in any particular order. These are just ones that I own that are happen to be some of my favorites. First up, we have Fantasy Star Portable, released 2009 by Sega. I love Fantasy Star, especially like the, the online series part of it where you can just run around and hack and slash at things, team up with people online. It's just a great experience. If you have not done anything with the Fantasy Star Online part of the series, I highly suggest going through and checking it out. Next up, we're going to have Final Fantasy Tactics War of the Lions, released 2007 by Square Enix. Square Enix did a really good job of redressing this, this game for the PSP, you know, in... They, they did take out a few of the, the quirks and some of the get-overs that you could do in the original PlayStation version and kind of updated things for the PSP. And it's a great game. There's a lot of fun to be had with this version of it where you can experience things a little bit different. You can't capture the Ultima Girls anymore. You can't do various other things like that. And or at least to the best of my recollection, you can't do that. But, you know, it's a great port of the game. It's great to be able to take it on the go. I believe they even have the game now on, on mobile devices, on phones and stuff, where you can play Final Fantasy Tactics. And I do believe that it is the War of the Lions version. But it's, it's a great game. It's a lot of fun. The music is wonderful. I love the artwork. I love the world. It's just... And the battle system is like just one of my favorites. And lastly, we have Final Fantasy Dissidia, released 2008 by Square Enix. This is another time where Square Enix decided they were going to shine on the PSP. And they created a Final Fantasy crossover fighting game. And this game controls a little bit different where it's... It's more of an anime style control where you zoom into someone, you zoom out of them, you strafe left, you strafe right, you can hit dodges and stuff like that and dodge around someone. It definitely reminds me of Dragon Ball Z fighting styles where they just zip around really fast and you're always targeted on your target. And I have to say this is probably one of my favorite fighting games on the PSP. It's quick, it's fast, there's not a huge learning curve, Any the entry point is just great, anyone can pick up the game and just start playing and not feel like they are at a complete disadvantage against someone who's really experienced, but you can also take this game to a whole new level and just become a master at it, where you know, you get through a round and, the, and your opponent just didn't even touch you. But, like I said, these are my favorite PlayStation Portable games. I would definitely love to hear what some of your guys' favorite games are as well. Please leave comments down below. Well, that's it for this episode of Mundane Designs. I'm your host, Mundane, and I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I enjoyed making it. If you like what you see, you can support me and my channel on Patreon by clicking one of the links below. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a wonderful day.